All right, here with head coach Lance Randall. Coach, uh, your thoughts on the game and the way the guys came out and played? Well, I, I thought that um, we came out and started out well, uh, but then Lynn ratcheted up the pressure, and I thought that we, we just, I don't know if we got tired coming off the break, if we were, um, but we really lacked some discipline, and it, it affected us on both sides of the ball. I thought offensively we did a poor job running our stuff, and then they just they got more and more pressure and we didn't execute our stuff we settled for jump shots and and um, just did a poor job in the offensive end it, it, what's disappointing with that too is that what we hold is our bread and butter is the defensive side of the ball and and I thought we let what they did to us offensively affect us on the defensive end and I thought our effort was poor um, it was our worst effort of the, of the year I thought our uh, intensity was bad our communication was was awful and uh, they got shots at the rim whenever they wanted them for the, for the most part. You know, we made a little run in the second half with some guys. Um, but, you know, for the most part, it was Lynn's game after the first media timeout. Yeah, that first media seemed to, to spark them. Uh, we went scoreless for about seven minutes there in the first half, and that kind of was the, uh, the gap right there. But when a team shoots 60% like Lynn did, it's always hard, unless you're shooting 60% with them. It's hard to uh, to keep up with them. So. Yeah, well, they, they shot sixty percent because we gave them layups. So they didn't they weren't they didn't have a hot hand. They only shot thirteen or fourteen threes. It was just a matter of uh, I, Evan. It was as bad as a defensive performance as I've been a part of. Um, and we've just got to be. We don't have to be better. We have to be unbelievably better to compete at a high level in this, this league. But I also think, and we said this going in. I think Lynn is an upper level team in our league. I, I really do. And. Um, Scott, I thought, had a great great pressure on the defensive side. I thought they shared the ball very well, and they got the ball to the right places. All right, Coach. Well, that kind of puts a period at the end of this game. Uh, but we'll move on, and we'll look toward, I believe, Tampa coming yeah. up on the 4th. Your thoughts on uh, the preparation for the Spartans at Tampa? Well, Tampa is uh, Tampa was has struggled a little bit early on, but now they've added a player in the last two games, and now they're getting about 20 points a game more than they were, which was their offensive troubles. And so now he's their... Their leading score the, uh, the last two games, so they're going to be a much better team than they were probably the first ten games of the year. Um, and obviously, it's a big rivalry game, and it's a big game. We need to rebound and do a better job defensively. They've been defending well themselves, and now they got a little more offensive punch. And we just got to get back to doing what we do, and um, we got to make sure we commit to it mentally and physically over the next few days. All right, coach. Let's see if we can't get our uh, step back uh, under us when we face the Spartans on January fourth. Happy New Year, Coach. All right, thanks, Evan.